بالله السميع العليم من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله ومن والاه وتبع هدا viewers at home السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته welcome you to a program uh, your favorite in Ramadan reminder this Ramadan our focus today is on al amru bil ma'ruf wa an nahy 'anil munkar that is enjoining what is good and forbidding evil promoting virtues and forbidding evils um, which is considered in islam as ra'sul amr the most important uh, engagement and action of muslim is to ensure that uh, we forbid we enjoy what is good we call people to virtuous deed and we warn them against the bad consequences of evil. We are bil ma'roof. They are enjoying good. We are nahawna anil munkar. And forbidding evil. Wa ulaika umul muflihun. Those will be the victorious. Uh, this is obligatory on all Muslims to promote righteousness in the society. Nigeria has a case study today. We all agree that the bane of our problem is corruption that has eaten deep into all facets of our life. It has become, become systemic and endemic that no, nothing works in a society because of corruption. We are a blessed country that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala had endowed us abundantly with human and natural resources. But because of corruption, uh, we find ourselves in this uh, pathetic situation that we are experiencing now. So we as Muslims, we must take it as point of duty. Everywhere we find ourselves, as professional, as artisan, in our places of work, in our neighborhood, in the society, in the government, in our ministries, that we should be uh, a man that takes no nonsense. A man that will do it the right way the due process man, somebody that will not take, uh, will not allow evil to prevail wherever he is. So that is the duty of Muslims. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala had ordered us to do that. And we don't have any alternative. There is no way about it. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, Kuntun khaira ummatin. That is why you are the best uh, generation ever evolved for mankind. When we lose this, then there is nothing left for us. Uh, one of the, the, the quotations says, they are not the real destroyer of society, those who engage in evil. But the real destroyers are those who are looking at them and doing nothing. They take no action, they say nothing. So we Muslims, we should be a kind of anti-graft, somebody that will be against uh, oppression, against evil, against uh, ill act in society be it moral be it financial be it political we must uh, be at the point of duty to ensure things are done the way they should be done al amru bil ma'ruf wa nahi anil munkar spiritually we must uh, ensure people are up and doing uh, financially they are upright morally they are upright politically they are upright that is the essence of al-amru bil ma'roof wa nahi anil munkar. I say noble uh, engagement. And that is the essence of sending prophets and apostles of Allah. Ya'muruna bil ma'roof wa yinhawna anil munkar. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make it an easy task for us. And may he uh, make it uh, efficient and functional. And uh, will leave positive impact in our society. Akulu ma tasma'un. Barakallahu li wa lakum. Subhanakallahu wa bihamdi. نشهد أن لا إله إلا أنت نستغفرك اللهم ونتوب إليك